Hello friends, welcome to Unity 3D Teacher Tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to make a point click to place a particular object in 2D. So we are going to see once the user click on the particular position, the object is will be placed on the exact same location. So this will be done in using a mouse and it will be same for an, uh, different platforms like WebGL or uh, android or ios OS. The, so the concept is same so let's see how to do that so let's create a script called game controller okay so we have created a script called game controller similar like i am going to have game con controller object so drag and drop the script so let's open the script okay so this is the script so once you open um, so what you're going to do is you are going to have uh, uh, yeah prefab first so the type of the object is going to initialize and then the position where we want to initialize so let's check how to initialize uh, so for example so this is the object we are going to initialize when the user clicking on certain position so right now it will be like this so I made a prefab so it will be available in prefab also so uh, let's create public game object author prefab okay so let's name as archer tower prefab okay next go to the game controller drag and drop that okay so once you drag and drop that so the prefab is ready so the type of the prefabs is going to initialize as been ready so next we want to see how to get the particular position when the user click on the mouse like this okay so in order to get the position i am going to have one return type so it's going to get the exact position where user is pointed the mouse okay so i am going to have public vector 3 get mouse post so vector 3 is going to have both x y and z okay so it's going to have one return type let's see what is that so let's have vector 3 get current post whatever name you like to have so it's going to get the current post so in order to get your current pose of your mouse click we need to have a camera so i'm going to initialize camera called cam so let's fetch that in short cam equal to camera dot main so since we have uh, only one camera so i generally initialize that it's a main camera so if we have multiple camera at a runtime, you just drag and drop in a public game of make it as public and drag and drop that is one more option otherwise you can go like this or otherwise you can find the reference of that using a game object dot find with the game object name that is one more option so right now I am going with general thing so cam dot you want to get uh, which type of portion is that you want to design so for example you want to make sure that in which axis it's going to get so i am going with screen to all point and then input dot mouse position so the reason why i am getting the input dot mouse position is so user going to touch here with the help of a mouse position so i am just touching that getting the mouse position and storing in that vector 3 whichever which is converted into screen to whole point so it's going to return a vector 3 okay 
so everything has been done so we are going to return this okay that's it so we got a get mouse position and then we are going to initialize so in order to detect a mouse click we are going to have one if statement if dot input dot get mouse button down of zero okay so here what I'm going to do is once whenever the mouse button is zero I mean the right mouse click I'm going to instantiate the prefab I mean the orchard tower okay and then transform parent uh, it means that uh, the exact position we want to do that so here we are going to return the mouse position okay so here we are going to get the mouse position and we are going to have here sorry we have one small error that's it so since it's a function we are going to get here with the help of a parenthesis and then that we don't need to change any rotation so i am going with quaternion dot identity so everything has been set now so let's check how it work save the script okay make sure that we have a archer tower here and click on that so if you see the archer tower is initializing but it's not showing in the window so the reason is if you see the mid camera the z axis is in different position so if it <coughs> if you change this to zero it will so show exactly okay so in order to avoid z and the depth here so make sure that leave current position dot is at equal to zero so we don't need current position of z we need only x and y see now we can able to see that so it's placing perfectly so you don't want to worry about the layers in later on videos we are going to change the layers so right now the object is placing perfectly so wherever the user positioning the game object so it will start placing it so that's it guys so first of all we are getting the mouse position and then we are uh, fetching the prefab and then initializing in mouse position of a right click orchard tower first and then the mouse position and then quaternion this is a rotation so rotation i am giving a generally quaternion dot identity which is means i am no going not going to change anything what prefab is giving that's it guys so if you think this video is very helpful for you please subscribe us and wait for the next video thank you